Hey friends, it is my once a month stuffing for my long term sinking funds. These are for emergency fund, Roth IRA, new car, um, travel, <laughs> Christmas, um, pet. I am going to do my pet binder today. Uh, so let's jump in emergency fund. This is my first one that I'm going to do. How much money do we have? So I have these envelope binders from Sav Saves. She releases them as limited releases. They usually sell out within an hour or less, <laughs> likely less, <laughs> like within the first 10 minutes, to be honest. Um, but these are awesome. I save money in here throughout the month. And then when I'm time, time is ready for me to do this stuffing, I pull out the category. Um, so how much do we have set aside for emergency fund today? We have 20, 100. So we have $100 to work with. So we're going to load up our handy dandy calculator. <laughs> and we're just going to jump right in. So this one is for emergency fund. This is a season to save. This is from Alicia, Elisha, <laughs> over at Hands and Bands. Um, this is her summer one. So it is it is summer. We need to start scratching. We are going to get 10 plus 10. So we're at 20. Let's do at least three. And 10. All right. <laughs> Thirty dollars it is, and this is one hundred and fifty dollars. She does them by season, so there's four seasons. All of them add up to one hundred and fifty dollars. I like knowing the amount that I have to save per season. That's not a mystery, um, and it's a very doable amount. So one hundred and fifty dollars every three months, I can do that. Twenty and thirty. <sighs> First one done. So normally we have a little bit more money to put into emergency fund, but we took our lovely road trip for our 15 year anniversary and we spent a little bit more than we should have. And when I overspend, it comes out of these savings categories. So I, as much as I would love <laughs> to be able to stuff all the money, um, I have to take that money from somewhere. So each letter has always been $2.00. Um, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So we are going to stick twelve dollars in here today. And I really didn't need the calculator. <laughs> Eleven, twelve. Not for this category. All right. So we are going to color this one in. And ta-da! That one is all colored in. We have our twelve dollars. So we officially kicked off our summer savings um, for both of these seasonal ones. I have just summer and fall left. This color in challenge is from Stacy over at Coffee and Budget. I absolutely love it. I think it's so cute. All right, Nigel's nuts. Are we nutty for Nigel? Yes, we are. All right, we don't have too many left. So each of these nuts is $10. I wish I could finish this one. 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, no, 50. Two, four, six, seven, eight, fifty-eight. We are two dollars shy of being able to finish Nigel's nuts. So let's do thirty dollars in here today because I have so many cute Liz challenges and I want to be able to do more of them. <laughs> so <laughs> let's get a little nutty here. And we did three, right? Okay, three dollars in. Well, thirty dollars in. <laughs> And so far we have saved 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. So this must have been a $150 challenge. This is when Liz was getting beefy and was like, you guys are going to save lots of money with my challenges. And I was like, Liz, I like them like around 100 or less. And she's like, mm, okay, I'll change it. <laughs> so now all future challenges are less and I love it. Get it, Liz and Les. <laughs> I have $26 left. So I could do bananas. I have my tiles. I have oh, so many good ones. 
I have this rolling with the Nomi's one and I'm nervous to do. <laughs> All right, let's do my tile one. This is from Erica Budgets. I just think it's so cute. You color in the tiles as you save. I see a six right here. I think I have $6 in ones. Two, four, six, eight. Mm. And I can't, I don't like to jump ahead. So, <laughs> all right, well, let's do the six. <laughs> we'll color in the one. And I could do another five. So we got the six in there. I could do another five. And then I'm down to a four. I wonder if like at the end of the day, we could somehow land okay with this one. So we put in the five. And you have to go in order. I mean, I could just randomly pick a die, but I don't wanna do a half a dice. <laughs> I don't know why. All right, so now let's do four. So we're gonna take out a one which I don't have. So let's do the two over here and two ones. So now we're gonna do the two and the two. So we're gonna do four. So I'm gonna put a five in and take out the one, five, six, seven, eight. And then we can do this one. Yay! It works out. Okay, back on track, back on track. <laughs> four. And I already paid that one, right? I think so. <laughs> Oh my gosh. And then five, six, seven, eight. Yes, this works out. Just trust in Erica and it'll work out. Six and two is eight. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, we have five left and that's fine because I have challenges that will take five. <laughs> so this one got quite a bit today. All right, so this is a $285 challenge. I so far have saved 125, 35, 40. So 140, 2, 4, 6, 8, 9, 50, 151. So we are over halfway done. And it's so fun. Like, it's just $6 here, $4 here. It just really adds up, and I really, really like it. <laughs> okay, let's do this last five into my monkeys because they're so cute. And the monkeys are from Quaint Prince Boutique. Do, 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 do. Um, and we're just gonna color in a lonely little $5 banana. <laughs> here, let's do one on the ground. Like, we're gonna try to trip somebody here. You know, the old classic joke banana. Yeah. All right, this is a $300 challenge. We have 50, 70, 90, $95, $100. So we're a third of the way done. Yes. Next up is Roth IRA, which I keep wanting to say 401k, but it's not. So Roth IRA, this one was our highest priority. It got the most of my money. Um, let's count and see how much we have. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 50. 75 dollars and I know we're trying to max it out so it's 6500 I believe for the year and so we have to go in strong if we want to max this out this is my retirement thing that I do for my husband um, he is self-employed and so I get to do a 401k through my work as an investing option but he does not so this is a way for us to invest in him all right so this one, we have $575. Uh, now I'm gonna use the calculator. <laughs> All right, let's finish off this row. So 40, 80, 160, 200, 40, 80, 320, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is hard. All right, so 40 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 320, so I was right. Minus 575, minus 320, $255 left. So we're going to color in this whole row of 40s, which makes me so happy. I'm going to color it in real quick, and I will be back. Ta-da! So that one's all colored in. 
Let's move on to the next one. I have this one from Erica Budgets, but I also have this one from D, so we're gonna do the one from D first. Um, this is Denise over at D versus Debt, and I absolutely love D. She has not been on. She has a lot going on in her life right now, and I just miss her. That's all. Let's do 100 out of here, so we have $155 left then. And when this one is done, this will have saved $1,600. So it's a really good amount. I love that they're divisible by 20s because a lot of times we go to the ATM and we grab 20s. <laughs> so trust me, this is a great challenge for many, many reasons. Okay, $155. This is where we get to have a little bit of fun. So let's knock off this 48 because that's a big number. And that leaves us with 107, but we want these big numbers gone. Um, let's knock off, where's the next one do you guys see? 46, should we do that one? I know, you guys were yelling at me to go somewhere else and I didn't do it and I don't, it's okay, it's okay. And if we do a 28, that gets us a 33. So that's perfect. We can do 28 and 33. All right, there we go. We spent $575 just like that. Boop, done. <laughs> so this save 2023 is from Erica Budgets. It's so cute. She, I believe, has a 2024 available. Um, D versus debt. And this first one which is the cutest, I think. It's a retirement couple. This is from Lisa Grateful Me. She has so many cute challenges, you guys. Like, all these shops are just, oh, so good. <laughs> all right, let's stuff this money. Technically, I could use a placeholder at this point. So, we might do some condensing here. We have 1,000. So, 1,000. <laughs> One, two, three four five six seven eight nine a thousand so let's grab a placeholder we'll do this one from busy lizzie's budget that she sent to me so we have two thousand fifty one fifty two fifty three fifty four fifty five hundred and we have this awesome one from ren all right, so that was 500 taken out. And now we have left 20, 40, 50. Holy cow. So we have $2,550 saved. That is amazing. <laughs> it's truly amazing. Ah, okay, we're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Next up is Christmas. So we take a little binder. We flip this to the back. Bada bing, bada boom. It's awesome. I honestly love these envelopes. <laughs> All right, for Christmas, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 45, 50. 250 dollars. This is a lot for me. I kind of beefed up Christmas a little bit because it's getting close, and yes. <laughs> All right. So we are going to finish the savings challenge. It was literally an IOU because we scratched it off and I got a stinky 25. Ooh, I have another one in there. Yay. <laughs> All right, so I owe $11. So we're gonna minus 11. Oops, 250 minus 11. There we go. That was hard, that was really hard. And then we'll color in this little IOU. These slips are from Liz over at Liz and Less. It's a printable, it's so cute. Um, and then, yes. <laughs> and this savings challenge was from Cat and Moon Design. Um, I just think it's so cute. So we have $239. I wanna work on this big beefy one first because all the numbers are between 40 and 55 and it saves $713. So I need to focus on this big one. 54. All right, so minus 54, 
we're at 185. We're gonna do another one because this is a big guy, guys. 352, 133, we're gonna keep going. Minus 43, this is where we get to the danger zone. 90, gosh, I've never had this much money. Like, I can actually go again, this is crazy. 46, okay, we're at 44. We're not gonna risk it anymore because honestly, <laughs> I, the chances of those being a 44 under are very slim pickings. All right, so we got that one done. This is from The Secret Budgeter. Um, yes, okay, so this is Cat and Moon Design. This is another one. Hers aren't as bad, although she got me with that 25 on the reindeer one. So six. 25, it's these corners. So if that's a 25 too, I can't do it. 13. Um, we're going to stop there and figure out numbers to hit 13 on this one. Because <laughs> I just, I feel like I'd be fine, but if I got another 25, which could be in this corner like it was on the last one, I can't do it. I can't do it. Okay, so let's figure out 13. 9 plus 4, 13. Got it. Yes. Okay. So there is our 13. We officially had our $250 done. This one, obviously, Larry's Adventure. This is from Elisha over at Hands and Bands. It'll save $300 when it's done. I just think it's so cute. It's a great way for me to catch odd and end numbers because I do scratch offs for Christmas. It is so unplannable. <laughs> you can't plan for it. So let's stuff this money to fitty. And I have more savings challenges in here. Dang. Okay. So we have 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, and 50 dollars. That is awesome. That honestly is so awesome. 850 dollars. <sighs> Or is it 900? I have another placeholder in here. We're at $900, guys. Yes. <laughs> okay. Travel. <laughs> this one does not get as much money. I will tell you that in advance. Um, this one, I think it's $100. 51, ooh, $200. Well, I'll be. <laughs> okay, so 200 $200. But we have an IOU of $5. Womp, womp. 200 minus 5. So we have $195 to go. <sighs> Let's start scratching. This book is from Elisha over at Hands and Bands. I absolutely love it. I am not following it with the seasons because I just do whatever pages feel good to me. So 10... 20, five, three, we have 140 left, three, <laughs> 137, that is a nine, 128, 10, 118, let's do, I'm going to skip a little bit to a higher amount page. Let's do this big Christmas one, because these have bigger numbers. 15. 15. 15. <coughs> so 188. Or 88. Not 88. Minus 10. I mean, that's a 50. <laughs> 25. Okay. So now this has 60. But this isn't a 60 if it's right next to it. 40. Okay. We can handle that. 40. Woo. Okay, now we're down to 13. Let's go back to our little page. <laughs> Let's do this one. 10. Oh my gosh. There's no way I'm going to get a 3. I mean, I did get a 3, but we're going to have an IOU. 10. All right, we owe $7 next time. <laughs> 
So let's add our little IOU slip here, and we're gonna add a seven. We owe seven dollars next time, which is perfectly fine with these savings challenge books. You have IOUs, you just do. All right, so two hundred dollars is going into travel. So in travel, we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 50, 500, 50, 600, 50, 62. 1,662 dollars. That is awesome. <laughs> it's so cool. It's just a little bit, I just save a little bit from each check and I stuff this once a month. So to stuff $200 to some probably seems like a lot but it's $50 a paycheck, it, it, but it all adds up. <laughs> I promise, it really does. Okay, home improvement binder. This one, we have 50 and 100. All right, so $100. This one, I just color in these little hexagon thingies. They're so cute. Um, this is from Quaint Prince Boutique as well. And if I have 100, I will take the first one. I always take the highest, 46, and then see if the a counterpart, there's no 54. So we're coloring a 46 for sure. And then we have 54 left, so let's say 27 and 27. So we can't do that one. <laughs> 100 minus 46. So we could do 28 and 26. So we could do these two. All right. I think hexagons might be my favorite shape ever. And this is a 50 envelope challenge. And so I'm just doing it instead of stuffing envelopes, I'm just coloring and stuffing in my binder. And I just love it. It's just so cute. <laughs> Okay, so, so far we have saved one, two, three, fifty-four. So 400, 50, 70, 80, 5, 6, 7. 487 dollars out of 1275. So we are getting there. We have big home improvement goals and I know a hundred dollars doesn't seem like a lot, but it will add up over time. <laughs> I promise. All right, so this I am saving up for a new car for myself. Um, my car is currently 12 years old and it works, but I know I'm gonna need a new car and I have this dream to walk in and just be able to buy a car outright. Now, will it happen? I don't know, <laughs> to be honest, but if much as I can get saved is all for the better. So I got this from Taylor Budgets. This is her 2022 version. She has a 2023 version and likely a 2024 in process. I have no idea, but I have the 2022 version. So this one is not available, but I love it. And 22 is my favorite number. So even though it's 2023, I don't care. <laughs> so the first one is multiply your savings. This is each week of the year, you take your number. So I picked number two since it's my favorite number and then you multiply it by the number. So for the month of July, because I'm this is for July, I'm stuffing in August. I'm saving $20, so four plus eight plus two plus six, $20. And we're gonna put that in the multiply your savings envelope. I do have matching envelopes for these savings challenges. Um, do I think it's necessary? Absolutely not. Um, I just, I thought it was fun. <laughs> 150, 70, one, two. So $172. I don't know what the total is gonna be, I guess I could add it all up if I wanted to, but I'm just doing it weeks by weeks. So by the end of the year, this will all be filled in. All right, next up is going to be 2022 is your year. Yes, we are going to finish this challenge. So I need to put in $20, $42, 20, 40, 2. So $42 is going into 2022 is your year and let's get this colored that one is colored in so 42 dollars is going in this one is going to be done yes okay so it says we should have 482 dollars 
Let's see if we have that. So 100, 200, 300, 400, 20, 40, 60, 82, 400 and $82 is done. And we started this in January um, and we are ending this in August on the exact same date, 8-8 on the 8th. All right, there we go. Yay, one down. Oh, once this whole book is done, it's like $8,000 saved. I got the low income version of it. Um, she had a higher one where you'd save like 20 grand. Yeah, I wasn't going to be able to do that. <laughs> I thought, let's start out with eight. Let's not jump a little too high here. All right, then we're going to skip to the $800 savings challenge. Um, I have only 20, 35, 7, 8. 20, 35, $38 left. So we are going to do, so let's color in, if I have $38, let's color in, what's the biggest number on here? 24. So you can do 24 and 14, perfect. All right, so we colored in 24 and 14, and this will be $800 when it's done. I am so excited. So, so far in here, we have saved 100, 20, 40, 50, 5, 60. So 162, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67. 167 out of the 800. So we definitely have a ways to go, but it is adding up. All of these different challenges are adding up. It, it makes me so excited. Okay, I know this video is long, however, <laughs> I have to do my puppy binder. I just have to. I'm sorry. Um, if you are ready to abort, feel free. I understand. This is a long video, but I need to do my pet. I am so excited. I love stuffing this one. It's one of my favorites, and I have a good amount of money today. So 50, 70, 90, 110, 120, 130, 135, 140. 42, 44, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. So $150. That's a good amount of money. <laughs> All right. So let's start off by loading our calculator because if you've watched my puppy binder stuffing, you know we are going to town with scratch offs. I have so many puppy scratch offs and I just love them i love them okay so this very first one is from saving with peggy um she is so cute <laughs> she has so many cute challenges she has this cute harriet um she has a froggy that she sent me oh she has so many good ones so ten dollars saving with peggy this is from reinventing renee she made me a spirit animal saving challenge and of course she picked my favorite kind of puppy well, Boston Terriers and French Bulldogs, I am equally in love with both of them. $11. Okay. <laughs> this is from Janelle Ray Budgets. Oh my gosh, the cuteness. Oh, can it get cuter? I don't know. $5. She's always good to me and does low numbers. <laughs> and then, of course, Sweet Ranger. Oh my gosh, Lizzie had made a post and she had to say goodbye to Ranger and oh, there's nothing worse than saying goodbye to your pet because you just love them and it's unconditional and oh, you just miss them like you walk in the house and they're not there and you know you go to like do something and they're not there we have trains that go by and with our dogs we'd always be like what was that and we'd like react to the train and then the dogs would get all riled up and Oh, that's the best, but you don't have dogs to do that, and it's sad. So $4. This one is from Ren at Mischief Managed Budget. She made it for me exclusively, and then you guys were asking for it, and so now it's in her shop, and I love that you guys wanted to do the same one as me because it's so cute. Okay, I have two of these from Budget Determined. Oh, yes. <laughs> Oh, let's see what Ozzy has for me. $2. I love that nice low number. And Rune, what are you going to give me? $5. All 
All these are being really nice. <laughs> oh. And then our last one, this is from The Humble Budgeter. This is Carmen. Oh, Carmen is so sweet. She has some really good stuff in her shop too. She spoiled me with this superhero one. When our dog had a cancer lump, we would put a Batman shirt on him and we called him Bat Dog. And so like this challenge just holds a special place in my heart because it brings back those memories. Um, not of the sad time of him dealing with cancer, but just the the bat, <laughs> the bat dog. And, oh, you know, we removed the tumor and everything turned out okay. Thank goodness. But yeah, it was, it, you, you get scared. Like that stuff is really scary. So we have $99 left to go. <laughs> I feel like it's 99 problems, right? Okay, so we need to put in money into our scratch up envelope. So if we had 150 and we have 99 left, that means we did $51 in scratch offs today. Whew, okay. That's what it's here for. We're okay with it. This is all going towards saving a dog. Our goal is to have $5,000. Um, let's see where we're at, 50, 150. 70, 90, 210, 215, 16, 17, 18, 19, 220, 1, 2, 3, 4. $224 just from these scratch offs. That is awesome. It honestly is awesome. Um, this is a duplicate because I already have that. That catches my extras. So let's go to this big beefy one. This one is to save a thousand dollars. Oh, so we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, oh yeah, we have 99. So let's do $80 in 20s and color down on these 20, 40, 60, 20, 40, 60, 80, 80. That color might be too light. <laughs> I like to be able to see it, you know, I don't want it to, there we go color over it. You want it to be dark and bright and vibrant. Um, so that's 80. And now we have 5, 10, 12, 14, 15. So we can do a 15. And what do we have left? Two, three, four dollars. All right. So this is going to go into our cookie jar. Um, let's count how much money we have saved in here. It is a good amount because this does save a thousand dollars. So, so far in here we have 100, so two fifties, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 260, 270, 280, 290, 300. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 57, 59, 61, 63, 65, 67, 68, 69, 70. Is that $370? <laughs> if I count that wrong, I it's fine. I will condense this later, but oh, we are getting there. Out of a thousand, we are getting there. Okay, last up is this little cookie. So this is from Rebecca from Here to Their Journey. She has this cute little squirrel cookie jar one. I use it as a dollar for each of the cookies. And it's a great way for me just to catch extra money. Oh, so good. <laughs> I just love it. So I'm going to fill in four of these because I'm just doing a dollar per cookie bundle. Others are doing it per cookie, so it's $3 in each one. I'm just doing it a dollar per bundle. So that's $4 in there. Oh, so good. Okay. So, so far we have saved. And again, this one's not going to collect a lot because this is just collecting extras. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven dollars. It's collecting our little odds and ends. But it's so cute. Oh, I just love it. All right, that is all. I apologize that this is a longer video. It is a lot of categories, a lot of money, and it all adds up just a little bit at a time. And it was 
so fun for me to stuff this. And I will see you guys on Friday for my savings challenge video. Bye.